Is there room on it? Of Hell's Kitchen. Continuation. The doors have not yeah. been opened for dinner service. <laughs> dinner service. Yeah. And dinner service. And Gina is already feeling the pressure. I'm sorry, but I'm doing this. Oh, let's go. Let's go back there. Sit down right here. Medic! Medic! Can you tell me your name? <laughs> Do you know where you are right now? I was like standing in line and I was getting overwhelmed. Okay. Are you feeling okay right now? Yeah, like, my mind's wandering about all the stuff right now. I need just to relax my system. And you're not dizzy or anything? No, I just don't want to be in a kitchen. Go, ladies! While the red team shucks, scrapes, and slices in preparation for the impending dinner service. Now we man down. What are we gonna do? We gonna pull it together. Up in the dorms, Gina focuses on Gina. I need to be away from everything, away from all my teammates, and She's have a cup of tea and is doing her eyebrows. And really? get myself together. Yeah. While the red team has lost the chef in the blue kitchen. Did anybody see how he preheated up the potato for it? One chef is just lost. He's got the potato right here, he's got the leeks right here, good to go. This is Bass, for Bass. Working side by side with Jeremy, and I'll tell you, I think he's an experienced chance for, I don't know how to make a point to, I'm just a little concerned right now. He does yeah, seem really so great. Right While Jeremy struggles He didn't even know what kind of steak he used for his dish. In the kitchen. And he's the head chef. No, he's the lead chef. Eat ahead, yeah. Just yeah. Like down a chef. Which, like I said, I'm taking is. I definitely think that without Gina here, we are a stronger team. You good, baby? I'm good. <laughs> we don't have that dead weight dragging us down. Go, ladies! <laughs> I just needed a rest, and I'm gonna bounce back really fast. She just kind of wanders oh, back in and so stands there you? and just like looks her miss? out. You missed everything. Oh, at least she put her hair up. Uh, right, ladies, Wait, go. she came back? Yeah, she went back in. Put her Wait, hair up. She just kind of walked in and just looked around. Stood there. This the chick's weird. Time. Oh, yeah. It's the big one. Yeah. It's the big one. Yeah. Let's be honest. I'm not looking for perfection, let's get that right. But I am expecting each and every one of you to give your best and for every customer to be fed. So, I'm guaranteeing a complete dinner service. How that sound? Guaranteed. Oh my God, this is our first time. That's not an easy thing to do. We it's a lot of pressure. Nothing to complete a service. <laughs> Good job. Oh, come on, JP. Oh, my God. JP, where have he been for three years? I told you to be here yesterday. Got too late. I, I really tried to be in time. Get changed, JP. I'm pissed off with that, honestly. Unreal. Okay, get on your stations. Let's go, guys. Open house. That really looks like you did it on purpose. What kind of bullshit are they trying to pull? Let's go. Tonight is the grand reopening of Hell's Kitchen. He's willing to the hell of it. And in addition to his Just classic menu, Chef Ramsay has added a tableside appetizer of ale steamed mussels, which will be served by Amanda in the red section of the dining room and by Christian in the blue section. I don't think I've ever had mussels. Accurate. Oh, Jake, wait. Yeah? 
Not big on chicken. Like oysters, yeah. clams. Yeah, you have know. disappeared for three years and then you, you I like scallops. Sorry, How rude. You don't like seafood, do you? Okay, ladies, on order. First ticket in. Three cups, table 31. Two burrata, one scallops, one mussels. Yes, chef. Okay, do you have a spatula? Where's the one that put the scallops in? What? Where's the other one? That's me, buddy. Crazy Gina, she doesn't know what she's doing. She hasn't been here all day. Now she wants to cook scallops. Oh, God. Really? <laughs> <laughs> I like this chick. <laughs> Gina's in La La Land. with the fucking voice? Yeah, with the, 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 she's kind of ugly with really bad hair. But she's like cute over, at the same time. Over. She looks like innocent or sweet or something Don't like that. Yeah, you can be friends with her. You ready, Gina? Yes, buddy. Uh, no, no. Lock it, girl, lock it. <laughs> she has to be able to go out to a range. This is not the way the Red Kitchen wants to start. Who took the scallops? Here we go. We're already going to get laid into it. Who took them? I did, chap. Ugh. Excellent. Uh, Thank you. These are the immaculate scallops. How does this happen? Good job, girl. Good job. To the shock of her teammates, Gina has delivered perfect scallops. <laughs> okay, scallops. While in the blue kitchen, the men How can funny be is delivered. That? I'm on them. Two results, eh? One muscle, one scallops. A response. The correct response is, yes, chef. The blue team's response is... Guys! Oh, yes, 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 chef. yes, chef! Thank you! For all the appetizers to be delivered to the first table at the same time, Sebastian on appetizers in the kitchen must be in total sync with Christian in the dining room. Did you guys like that spicy or not? Oh, a slight kick. Slight kick? Just a rock in the little pan. I've worked in different restaurants. I know how to make risotto, but like, I've never really focused much on cooking Italian food. I'm not putting it down, it's just like, I'm Mexican, so I like those spices more. Sebastian, how long? Walking it out. Thank you, there you go. But come, you, you don't, come, like, thank you. there's one way to cook it and that's it. Yeah. <laughs> you can't add your own flair to it. That's cool. Hold on, come here, quick. I don't need quick. Taste. Oh my god, here we go. Please no. And first ticket. Undercooked. These are under yeah. Regroup and get it together. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Can I get the risotto with no peas in it? Can you do that in the house kitchen? Probably not. What could peas please? Thank you, sir. I think you can. I don't know what to do. My muscles are ready. I've heard so him do things like that before. before. I'm really pissed right now. I'm doing my part out there. Because that looks good, but without the, the first piece. table together. Yeah. Oh, and by the way, the muscles have been served to the table. While Sebastian starts over on the risotto, Gina. I mean, all he's got to do is nap from in there. Is anxious to prove her earlier success was no fluke. Sorry, Ramsey. I don't like cooked peas. You're almost done. I just told you I'm in. That's my problem with fine dining, you know? You can't change things and I don't like classes. Shut up, Gina. Nedra won't tell me anything. Scallops going in. So I'm whipping up the scallops. Scallops ready. No, 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 no. I need two minutes on risotto. Two minutes. You crazy bitch. Why did you put the scallops? Now they're gonna be burnt. Right behind you, Chef. All of you, come in. Let me show you a little waterfall. Every time Kay and I ordered something on the cruise, yeah, it was all fancy. Kay had um, perching. I had like three different kinds of steak. Gina, don't throw me under the bus. What else? She had a couple friend. of other fancy things. I had this just thin call. cut duck you breast for, there, for an right? appetizer. I just like really this fancy stuff. I can't remember all of it. Yeah. I know that but every time it came with something on the plate the that neither one of us knew what it was. Yeah. <laughs> like it's great. we didn't need it. We were like the one time it was this big green ball. It was probably, uh, was it wasabi? No, it was like some kind of pate or Pesto. something like that. I wasn't going to dare eat it. <laughs> Kay tried a lot of things, though. I was impressed. Who just got booted? Scallop lady, Gina. 
was delicious. Thank you, sir. Go, ladies. <laughs> uh, B, B, woo! Nedra, how many minutes? Uh, five minutes, okay. She walks right minutes. up to the mirror. Two minutes ago. I and starts so doing her face pissed. again. Those little bitches. They better watch out. <laughs> There's gonna be more. Wow. I mean, she doesn't look bad for 50, but I think she's a little obsessive, compulsive. I used to sleep on the tour bus between shows. The, the, she's a lot psychotic. The creative process never stops. And songwriting is so hard, but I love it. These days, I guess I just don't want to miss a thing. <laughs> I miss you guys. That's me. Thanks for getting buzz, Jesus. New windows phone. Reinvented around. Oh, Fuck. I you don't. You gotta sleep on there. Oh, I feel so bad for you. Ooh, <laughs> I don't want to miss a thing, and then the next thing, words out of her mouth are. I miss you guys. I see it's done. Yeah. Without compromising performance, we build Mazdas. Where do you drive? Now get the 2013 Mazda 3 with Sky Active technology for 0% APR for 60 months. Tell this guy what I drive APR every time this commercial comes out. Possibly. I feel like it. America, ladies and gentlemen, I love my Volkswagen. Get off my nuts. <laughs> I didn't know she owned restaurants. I'm being pissed off that I can't find the cheese and garlic right somewhere. I um, looked at Walmart too. It's the only one I want to try. And then I looked again at Wegmans when Kay and I went because you said you saw him like right or something. Yeah. Once again, finds themselves genoless in the kitchen. While on the blue Maybe side, we should look at the radio by my house. The men are choice. finally ready to impress Chef Ramsay with their second attempt on the first order of appetizers. Come on, guys. Start this, please. Here we go. Come on. Blue team is on a roll. Second ticket. Keep it rolling, guys. Three company will start for muscles. How long? I need uh, 60 seconds. We are finally done together as a team. Walk it. Gallop walking up to the bed. Excuse me, sir. Taste that. How hot is that? That's spicy. <laughs> All of you, taste that. It's too spicy and it's disgusting. Special. And again, scallops cook beautifully. What the f is going on? It's like deja vu in this. <laughs> How many times have you cooked scallops tonight and not served them? Spice, chef. Sorry, Sebastian, get it together! Yes, yes! Come on, guys, let's go. Okay, my G-Waggy. I messed up a few times, but I'm getting in with the groove. I'm playing around. i to make the environment a little bit looser. Jackie, we got talk to me. Here, just here. focus on cooking the freaking pasta. And making it the same every time and not the way you want it. Chef, Zach! I look at me. I look at This is a f***ing job. No, Chef. Zachy Wacky. I just apologize about that, Chef. Yeah, do me a favor. Get out! Yes, chef. I'll put you. Get out! Yes, chef. Upstairs! Get out! So Sebastian gets kicked out. Didn't hear that coming. Wacky. What are you doing? Where the hell are you going, Sebastian? Okay, yeah, you can go back. Second time! Get out! Where's he going? God, are you kidding me? Wacky! He just came running through the kitchen. And it's up to John to handle the appetizer station solo. I need two minutes, please. While in the dining room, my blue team's black cast up a little bit, so I'll give it a muscle. Uh, okay. Christian is successfully serving muscles. Do I still get the risotto? Whether the diners ordered them or not. <laughs> I just started going to the table that had their food late for so long to try to help our blue team out. So I like That's even the to my team <laughs> man. Hope you guys enjoy. Wow. I know you ordered risotto, but it's taking you forever here. Has some muscles. The red yeah. team is cranking out the appetizers. <laughs> yeah. 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 Now, it's up to Jessica and Cindy on the meat station oh, and Danielle and Susan so on Garnish to keep up the momentum. On order four, come to 51. Entree, one chicken, one short rib, pasta to Wellington. Yes, sir. I don't understand how you're expected to remember all the tickets. Six covers white table 30. Entree, two halibut, one bath, one pork, one lamb, one Wellington. Yes, you're only supposed to remember your own. 
Okay. I've never worked in a brigade before. Oh, really? Never. I cannot believe that Daniela is a head chef. A head chef of what? A hot dog stand? Three risotto, two burrata? Let's go. What are you reading out for, Daniela? I was trying to see if that was a ticket to see what we even just called. Where's your ticket that I just called? Well, it's supposed to be here. And, and it's not there. Let's walk three steps together. Yes, sir. One, two, three. Yes, sir. And it's there. You're making such hard work out of nothing. I have no idea why Daniel can't get it together. I'm embarrassed for her. Three steps. First ticket, second ticket. Yes. Okay? Yes. No f off. Yes, thank you. Well, Danielle gets a lesson in Kitchen 101 okay. on the blue side. My risotto's ready to walk, dude. Just go. John, without the help of Sebastian. Good. Let's go. Has gotten the men back on track. And the guys have definitely won this. And they are now ready to move on to entrees. Two lamps to wait. Five minutes in the window. Yes, chef. Five minutes in the window. I'm pretty excited about working meat tonight. I decided that I was going to do the lamb and Theron as the Wellington. Wellington did. I cook lamb every day. I mean, we run it for specials. I was even thinking about putting it on my next menu. Jeremy. You know, for a Greek guy, George does not serve lamb. I need to still cut it. Really? Yeah. Uh, once it rests, bro. All right. Ready to go? Put it in the past. I know my lamb's perfectly cooked, so I don't think we have anything to worry about. It's hot. Actually, his Rusaka and Spanakopita are frozen. He won't even recommend eating them. I don't know why he doesn't make his Greek stuff fresh. Can they make all the homemade soups? All the specials every day are homemade. While the blue kitchen waits for a do-over on Michael's lamb, and over in the red kitchen, he doesn't cook any of his Greek stuff fresh or homemade. Let's go. Chef Ramsay is looking That's for weird. Cindy and Jessica to deliver on the meat station. Did you put your lamb back in? No. You got to brown up the crust, and we got to let it rest before slicing it. You're right. Jessica's fresh out of culinary school, so this could be a disaster. Uh, or it could be the best right thing ever, because she's ago, fresh off of learning everything. This, life and walk. this is not rocket science. <laughs> Seriously, slice the lamb. How long does it really take? How much of an amateur are you? Wow, two minutes, and she's only three quarters of a way through the first oh my God. cut. This bitch is cutting lamp for six hours now. Bitch, it's only two and four hours in a day. Oh my God, three and a half minutes to cut the first piece off. She's still got to do it again. Those lamb chops look good. <laughs> is she the one that's fresh out of culinary school? Yeah. Great. Who took the lamp? Me, Chef. Perfect. Thank you, Chef. Well, it, it took you like an hour to cut it. Well, if you're gonna cut, if you're gonna take your time to cut it, you might as well cut it perfect. At least you got it right, right? Yeah. You gotta give her that. Over in the blue kitchen. Garnish, two lamb, two Wellington. But three minutes to cook, make one cut is a little bit much. Perfectly cooked, but Michael's lamb. Those Wellingtons look good. Wow, they look so crunchy. I had Wellington on the boat, but the pastry was not. Come on, come on. Crispy on the outside the way it should be. Wellington's yeah. are hard to cook. I was waiting for the lamb, waiting for the lamb, waiting for the lamb. It's like meeting, it's not even anymore. You need to go. Yeah. Hold on, hold on. Wait for me. Can't rest no more. We gotta go. Guys, walk into Wellington. F me, man. Barrett, thanks for that, buddy. I just can't believe this is happening right now. Lamb! Why didn't you cut the lamb open and just sear him a little bit then? Can you do that? It's embarrassing. Uh, oh god. It's coming back. Time out! No! The bone! Pick up! Than the meat! There needs to be meat on there. This is not a dog's chew toy. This is lamb. And if that's not bad enough, they're way overcooked. Oh. Michael and Barrett! Dumb and dumber! You don't slice the Wellington until the lamb's ready. Yes, yes. Oh, it's together like... Oh, you... Chuck, so can I please come back, Chef? Dude, really? What are you doing? <laughs> Perfect. Right in the time Dude, of them getting yelled at. The Perfect first fucking one. timing, he says. <laughs> you look stupid. No, Chef. The blue team, one hour into service, and not one entree out. Really? You. The last time... I thought they were doing so good. him and him. <coughs> Get out! I guess I was wrong.
Well, you know, if uh, they didn't have multiple fuck ups right there, they would have been alright. What? You said if they didn't have multiple fuck ups right there, they would have been alright. Um, I wish an asteroid would hit the American Idol downstage. <laughs> Right in the middle of the show. Forever trying to find. Wait, everyone can see it. Now, the new smart TV searches TV. My only regret would be that I missed it. But I get to see it in my It's all good. You people are gonna do what we say. Uh, I can't do this anymore. This is what we always do. Yeah, this whole do what I tell you stuff. It doesn't work for me anymore. So what are you gonna do? It's open better. Fine. That's your turn whenever you want it, baby. Yours is gonna stop restricting me. Okay, baby. What they want. Now your choice is simple. It's just over an hour into Hell's Kitchen's opening night, and the blue team has failed to deliver a single entree to the dining room. And the unwelcome return of Sebastian. Okay, please come back then. You, you come in. Has pushed Chef Ramsay to that the limit. That works until I figure yeah. something else out. For the last time, say him and him and get out. And let me tell you something. You come back downstairs again, you'll be leaving through the front door. Now get out, Sebastian. Yes, Baby. You, <laughs> on meets. Yes, sir. You, on meets. Yes, sir. Oi. I didn't do anything to get kicked out of this dinner service. You overcooked the Wellington. Chef Ramsay looks to Ray and Anthony to step up and rescue the meat. We've already cut. Close them up. But over in the red kitchen. Where's the cow? He's looking for something else. Kale? Yes. Black cow for the lad looking for a uh, You didn't ask me, Danielle. Danielle, get it together. She's cooked the lamb perfectly in garnish. Where's the kale? Come on, Danielle. I'm trying. I've never done this before. I need the kale. <laughs> the protein's nailed perfectly, and then we some kale. Sonia! They have to move in yes, one minute, Chef! Just lightly, lightly, lightly tossed. Ken yelled all over the place. She doesn't know what she's doing. Like that? More along this color. I'm spending more time babysitting Danielle than I am worrying about my own garnish. How did she make it on the show? Ladies! She's a head chef. Touch that. For what, a private household? That's oh, my garnish. Who cooked that? I did, Chef. Yeah, you. Get out. Uh -huh. Get out. Hey, man. You think it's funny? No, no, no. no. Take it with you. I know this is not funny. I don't deserve to be kicked out of the kitchen. Danielle does. She was the one bringing the station down. I actually, uh, yeah. I feel bad for her. That time it really wasn't her fault. You took it to Wellington. You Wellington. Yes, Chef. Sorry, Chef. I'm confused. Do you need the one for the redo and the two chicken and two Wellington? Or do you just need the two chicken and two Wellington? Get out! <laughs> <laughs> Get out! Really hard. Maybe can you have me the pencil that's up there? Uh, While the women look for someone to step up on the garnish station. Uh -huh. Let's go! Someone help! We gotta get this chicken garnish going! Chef Ramsey. Blue team! Let's go! Pushes the men to keep the entrees coming. Walk it, Chef. Two lamb, Chef. Service, please. Keep it rolling, guys. Three out of them, one fast one chicken. Come on, come on. Yes, Chef. Yes, I'm looking at Jeremy. He's sauteing off kale. I can he's sauteing kale and he's created a flare up fire. Chef, turn that down, Chef. Yeah, yeah. How do you even do that? I'm not. Worry about your side, let me do my side, yeah? What? Wow, dude. Hey, no territory. He's trying to help you, you're like burning kale. So shut up. And he tells him not to serve and he says he's not. <laughs> Three halibut, one bass, one chicken. Get out of the window. What are we going with? Two, uh, if you're sauteing it in olive oil, I think you have to keep it low because it has a high smoke point. Three halibut, one bass, one chicken. What are we going with? 
the three sleep the three three halibut the two two uh one bass one chicken <laughs> Jeremy, he's telling it to you. Just say it right back, man. Pretty sure birds can do that. <laughs> three halibut, one bass, one chicken. What's going on? Three halibut, two. Get out! Get out! Bye bye, Jeremy. <laughs> Jesus Christ! <laughs> it's 90 minutes in opening night. Mary! And with three wow. members of the red team already kicked out of the kitchen. I've never worked in a f brigade before. The rest of the team is struggling to fill the vacancies. Oh, shit. I can take, Josh, I can take full orders of entire four tabs. Yeah. What they, their food, their, their sides. Don't, please. Don't, please. Don't, please. I, I used to do it at Chili's all the time, and I do it even here sometimes without even writing it down. <laughs> Seriously. This fucking guy can't repeat. And right I smoke him. all the time. These people look at me and they're like, aren't you going to write that down? I'm like, no, I got it. And he can't write it. <laughs> you know what I mean? Like, I am no fucking genius. <laughs> and I can remember four full orders. I'm just like, relax, channel the inner zen. I can't do a six top. When I start getting to five and six, then I start mixing things up. Damn thing right now. I need water. I mean, I guess I could if I had to, but it's not a good idea. Uh, I'm not a... Oh, shit. Ramsey fucked up. And she called him out on it. It's just a piece of chicken on a plate. <laughs> what are you doing? There's nothing else to it. Get out. Get out. Jeff Ramsey told me to get up. I'm like, all right, I'm gonna go upstairs and rehydrate myself. Mary, Charlie, coming, Jeff. Thanks to Mary, the red Mary. team finally delivers That's the, the missing potatoes. Hot can but in the blue kitchen, the chicken is going first. Chef Ramsey finds himself asking a familiar question. Where's the chicken garnish? Why? Garnish the chicken. And what about the risotto appetizer? Yeah, 45 seconds. Can you be more cooked? Dad, come here. Just touch that. Alright, Jack. Jack, please, come on. You're like five people down in the kitchen. I need you, baby. I know that. We are going to complete dinner service. No matter what. The risotto's going up. The risotto's up. Look at that there. Stuck to the bottom of the John, take that on yourself and get the out of there. When somebody gets kicked out of the kitchen, they put more pressure on the next man. We got a cow going on. Fingers. Spoons are everywhere. Wake up. Ray, you just stuck your finger into a risotto. In front really? Of Ramsey in Hell's Kitchen. That's just stupid. You might be the oldest, but I respect you. Oh, yes, sir. He, oh my god, he just took a big scoop of it with his index finger. It was disgusting. I'm not feeling this right now. It's getting hot. I'm starting to feel the pressure. You good? I gotta just breathe, homes. Results are. He looks like he's panicking. I would be you're like one of what? What, two left in the fucking kitchen over there? Yeah, it's just two of them. You're responsible for everything? Another person gets kicked out, that's like another blow to me. That was X there by I himself. I something in my stomach. I literally feel my body shutting down. Well, where's Zach? Oh my God. Zach keeps leaving the kitchen. <laughs> All I'm thinking to myself is, don't go under, don't go under. Zach. Zach! <laughs> oh my God. Did this fucker just puke all over the place? I think he did. He was in the bag. Pressure's getting to him. Holy crap. That's just too funny. Well, I'll get his. You're not gonna die. Well, that's the thing. Don't get me wrong. I've felt that way before. Like, I've had too many tables. 
I've yeah, had too much it. going on. Much. You know what I mean? I've known that people have been sitting there for like 15 minutes and I haven't even done anything but said, I'm sorry, I'll be right with you. And there's two more tables with no drinks and there's three tables worth of food that needs to be... Like, I've been there. You feel like, you know, you want to get to everybody at the same time, but you just stop and do one thing at a time. Well, I mean, it's you not... Don't, you just fuck shit up anyway. It's not fucking rocket scientists. No one's going to die. You know what I mean? Yeah. You working in a fucking restaurant. Christ, the worst thing that's going to happen is you're going to get fired. Guess what? There's a million other fucking restaurants out there. And new ones are opening every fucking day. That's the great thing about it. When I used to work in Florida, I used to just quit because I was hungover. <laughs> and the very next day, I would walk into a couple restaurants and I would get hired on the spot every single time. Two hours. There's that many of them. It's like Jefferson kitchen. Road, only in longer. The kitchen, Zach is the, the last 19. Man standing. Freaking crazy. Uh, barely. I'm feeling dehydrated. It's getting hot. And <laughs> I'm starting to lose consciousness. Really? Uh, oh, my God. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Oh, oh where's that? My God. Zach! Zach! What are you doing? I'm throwing up for a minute. Let me just get this out of me, please. Throwing up. Try now. Oh, ladies. Oh, God. I'm literally telling myself, if you think that, you know, you're going to pass out, uh, guess what? Think again. Zach. Zach. Sounds okay? to me like you talked yourself something. right into a Monster. panic attack. First up, yep. I can feel out of it. Yeah, I'm finishing that up. I got it, Jeff. Shove it, Zach. Shove it, Zach. Bye, Zach. All right. Yeah, too bad, Shove it. T-Bass. Go, please. As Zach rises from the ashes... Woo! Let's do it! Frustration is rising amongst the 12 ousted chefs. I got kicked out of the kitchen. Because I couldn't repeat back the orders. You got it? Repeat back the orders. You got to be able to know that. Good communication. Keep crumbling. <laughs> First of many. I've been cooking for half my life, okay? I've never worked in a brigade before. There's hardly any restaurants that work that way. Danielle is making sure everybody knows that I've worked in a brigade system before. Guess what? We know! We <laughs> know this already! What restaurants have you worked in? I've worked in this kitchen before. Curiosity, show of hands. Guys, how many people have worked in a true brigade before? Well, Danielle Everybody has a part, there's an expo the person, system. they read out the tickets, Stairs. everyone brings Red up their thing. What, how is that complicated? Walking. How else would you do it? And on the other I work in a diner and that's how they do it. And entrees are flying that's how everyone does it. Well. <laughs> there's a toast guy, there's an egg guy, there's a waffle guy, you know? I'm determined to finish service because what don't kill you only make you stronger. I literally threw ice in my chest. And there's an expo. Even in a diner. I'm feeling really good right now. We completed the first thing. This is unbelievable. So the two big bitches and the Mary, the ugly chick with the high voice were the ones that seemed to actually hold her own. Yeah, had stood out in the very first round. They did complete the service. That was something. I haven't no, seen I that in a couple of hell's kitchens. complete. I did a service. But I expected all of you oh. to be here when I finish. It was a difficult evening, but I will choose a winning team. I guess the red team had more people. The red team. Congratulations. They had three people. The blue team only had one. Zach. Yeah, but Zach did you're all fucking... Up. That's the Th yeah, that's true. You gotta give Zach extra credit. All of you could get harder. Blue team, time to do something that you couldn't Even do Even though he tonight. freaked out. <laughs> I'd like each and every one of you now to work as a team and decide which two chefs you'd like to nominate to get the f*** out of here tonight. The f*** off. The f*** off. Hey, chef. <laughs> yes, chef, he says. My team, they let me down. But I guarantee you, the guilty party will be penalized to the utmost. The two stations that dropped their ball was Sebastian's station and Michael on me. As far as Michael, I agree. I did the well on him because he said he was ready with the lamb. Michael was a disaster. 
He's an executive chef. He's been doing it for a while. Michael, you should know better. What's Seriously, Numbnuts no, couldn't rep 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 repeat back four things that were said to him. And I have yeah, that could be just, just the nervousness. Now, that I mean, said, somebody else that can't even. Mm -hmm. I mean, you gotta know when to be serious and put your head down. Well, you know what I mean? And you know, you gotta know when to joke around. Sebastian really needs to hit the brakes. This guy's a clown. I haven't seen him serious for a second since he's been here. I like to have a good time at work, man. I do too. I, I like to make jokes. I like to have a good time. But when it's in the kitchen, man, you try to crunch. When you came in three times and then I got kicked out? What the f*** were you thinking, man? Coming back in three times? There was only a second time. No, you came back a third time. It's very easy to point fingers. Tonight we all screwed up. What pisses me off is I wasn't playing around. I was actually trying to put out some good food. For me, I got to nominate Gare. Not because he's not a good cook, but like he's not the strongest guy on the team. I have to second on, on Jeremy, not because I don't like you, cuz. But like, what happens tomorrow when we get in service? You guys know you're voting on me, not because I can't cook, but because I couldn't repeat back in order. Now, can I tell you why I will vote for you? Yeah, yeah. that was when pretty I see fucking retarded. The, the greens literally turning brown, but I told you I got it. When you talk to me in that tone of voice, and with that, you got it. When you're burning when kale. Your side, let me do my side, yeah? You were yelling at me. I'm yelling at right I now. I did not yell at you. Jeremy <laughs> reminds me of a young punk with a lot of mouth and nothing to back it up. You're taking me out because of what I said, but can I can't cook? So, no, you can't cook. You ain't doing it good, playboy. I'm not doing it good. You ain't doing it I'm good. I'm 22. I got a lead position. Watch what he's going to step on you when I'm bigger. Watch That's on cool. something and you ain't nothing. Oh, what, Perkins? you stepping on me real hard, bro. <laughs> None of us are. No, he just stepped on me real hard. You don't even know where the I'm from. All right. I'm going to turn this. Right. So you like it working on Windows 8. Here's the desktop that you know and love. You still use Word, Excel, PowerPoint. I can snap two apps side by side. And if you're lost SkyDrive, you can log in to any Windows 8 device with your Microsoft ID. That is awesome. See this tablet we've been using? Mm -hmm. There's your keyboard. Uh, Windows 8 works great with touch or the keyboard and mouse. So work, play, <coughs> color. Fantastic. Watch out. My system. I'm actually a very impressive. Wow. <laughs> Only Mazda is so obsessed with the future of driving that it's revolutionizing everything. Skyactiv technology makes vehicles stronger with a top safety pick and more fuel efficient, like the EPA estimated 40 MPG Highway Mazda 3, without compromising performance. We build Mazdas. What do you drive? Now get the 2013 Mazda 3 with Skyactiv technology for 0% APR for 60 months plus 500 APR cash. Lay's Ass Shooter creates the next great potato chip flavor. Ready to try the finalists? Lay's Chicken and Waffles. Watery, syrupy. My That's Lay's Sriracha. Look for it. Candy with a spicy kick. This is my new favorite. And finally, cheesy garlic bread. Let me guess your favorite. I've got to try. America, you decide. Try all three for a limited time only. We're going to eat one chip. It said voting ends 5-4. Chef four. has asked the blue team for two nominees. Maybe they'll and show Michael up in April. And Sebastian have been singled out. But another candidate has emerged. Jeez, they sure made me want to try a fucking potato chip, didn't they? Real hard, bro. None of us are right now. Real hard. You don't even know where the f*** I'm from. The man now I feel like a chef. No, when I see you doing it wrong, and I don't say nothing. What did that make me look like? Now I know it's you cooking a dish, but what the f did that make me look like? When insulting people before you try their food. You feel like that stuff, why do you say stuff? Man, taste I asked. I asked. I asked everybody to come try it. Did they ask any of you? Zach's putting me under the bus. But I'm not gonna go down easy. He wouldn't even let him he told him to get away. And I'll be better than everybody else. And I'll know it. <laughs> Why are you gonna trip on someone's career like that, dude? You're gonna say my career is just a career. When I say you, when I say my career, hey, shut hey, shut you just not doing that right. Who my station? Everybody off my station. You did it to yourself, dude. The nerve of this guy, because he knows what the f he's doing. Where are you the f on guy? Duh, you out of here.
have you reached a decision? Yes, to work as a team. Yes, Thank God for that. Zach, who is the blue team's first nominee and why? We have nominated Jeremy because he saw something that wasn't going right with one of the conditions that he was doing and he refused to take the criticism, telling us to get off the station and he got it. The mistake of the, of the cooking is one thing, but then the arrogance to not want it to be corrected is something totally different. We can't have that kind of attitude in our kitchen going on. I'm not asking you to kiss each other's ass, but when you walk in that blue kitchen. No, but I have my own. Oh. Jeremy, are you arrogant? Is that right? No, it wasn't that I was arrogant, Chef. I was frustrated at the situation, Chef, and I lashed out. Frustrated you lashed out. And whilst your frustration building, you're lashing out, and the customers aren't getting fed. Zach, second nominee and why? Our second nominee is... If you stash tissues like a squirrel stashes nuts, you may be muddling through allergies. Try Zyrtec. <laughs> or you may have Nothing a freaking hoarding disorder. Nothing starts working faster relieving your allergy symptoms Seriously. for 24 hours. Zyrtec. Love the air. When you invite your friends to Hulu Plus, you can earn up to one year free. Here's how it works. You invite your friends to sign up. When they do, both get two weeks free. The more people you invite, the more free Hulu Plus you get. So start inviting your friends today. Up to a year. Right, so if I do year. sign up like 30 people, then I don't get it for the extra After one. a rough dinner service, where almost the entire team was sense. kicked out of the kitchen, the men have made a tough decision. We have nominated Jeremy. But they are not done yet. Second nominee of one. Our second nominee is... Hello? Sebastian. Watching Hell's Kitchen, Sebastian what are you doing? It's a good job, but it's a time and a place to play. Zacky, wacky, in the middle of certain, like, you know, we're trying um, to Well, yeah, if you have, have one. Dad said you had his extra card. If you're not card. serious now, I don't got you getting serious at all. Jeremy, Sebastian, step forward. Let's do it. Ah, that is not what he told me. He said, I have two cards and Brian has the other one. That's what he said. Sebastian. Ice. Seriously, you want to f around in the middle of service? Why do you come in here? I love cooking. It's something I love to do, and I've been. I've been I mean, if you time. have to stop Today, in with me real quick, that's fine. My I can, comes you out know, the it should be on your way home or Before whatever. I but here, I just want to get the TV out. My attitude. Oh, you're off and, tomorrow. Uh, something I All right. Correct. I was probably gonna call Alan tomorrow yeah. anyway. You're probably the youngest in this competition. You're in. Yeah, I'm, I'll be out tomorrow. I gotta work 6.30 to 2, though, so I'll be out of work, too. I've tried to do better. I've always done better. All right, I'll get a hold of you when I get out of work, then. i almost everything I've tried. Okay, cool, thanks. Today I failed. Okay, bye. I plan on failing ever again, Chef. I let my team down, and I never do that. Not only did you let your team down, you then gave them okay. You thought you started okay. the weeds? You started to get the team? That was one comment, Chef. One comment. One comment. So cool. <coughs> the person leaving house kitchen. Sebastian, give me a jacket. Oh. It's a kitchen, not a place for comedians. Idiot. Good night. The Mexican? Yep. Zacky Wacky. Right now I'm disappointed with myself. I came here thinking that the challenge was going to be to beat the other chefs and win those kitchen. And I found a way to defeat myself. Yes, you did. Those kitchens, man. It's no joke. This is not a game for me. This is serious business. Understand? Yeah, yeah. 
get out of there. Now, this is a fight. And I'm not leaving. I'm staying. He's a good cry. Home, but if we lose, she the first sucker that's getting voted off. I'm voting with two hands, and my hoo-ha count is two-two, so that's four hands all day. I can't keep carrying these guys. I can't keep throwing them on my back. Biggest question on my mind is, who's the next I'm getting out of here? Because the star, the head chef here, the chef Zach. Sebastian tried to be funny, but it was his cooking that was the joke. Brian's stopping over tomorrow. Um, Brian's off tomorrow. And I told him I will get a hold of him after work because I have to get poo 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 poo, -poo anyway. So I will see him somewhere, but I don't know where. I guess it depends on what Alan's doing. But he said I could use his BJ card. Apparently He's on the account with my dad, and it's his card for the account. Oh, okay. Whereas in my dad told me it was his other card. But I'm like, okay, whatever. It doesn't matter. I can still use it. It doesn't make a difference. Yeah. There were no new cartoons this week? Or they're not on there yet? One of the two. Check Shit. The Simpsons. Simpsons. What did we just watch? Eleven uh, burgers. three? Uh, what? You mean on the website? No, on the disc. Wasn't that uh, eleven three? Something like that. Uh, listen to what they said. The Simpsons, the longest running primetime animated series in history and the longest running comedy on primetime television. Okay. <laughs> Who phrased that like that, you fucking retard? Yep, nope, the newest one is the oh, we already watched. Burns one, yep. Burns is Batman? Yep. Um, <coughs> holy crap, so much crap going on now. Okay. I'm going to candle this smell like a cookie. I'm like, what is that? It's that candle. <laughs> I don't understand why it doesn't automatically connect K to the... Internet? Yeah, she's got Xbox Gold. Oh. Yes, I see that. Oh, over here it smells really... Oh, because the fan's sucking it out, that's why. So, you know what I should do? I don't. Move it over here. So that it has to suck it across the room. A little bit more. Um...
Really? Deuce is playing Prototype 2? Really? Well, I don't know, is he? Yes, he is. Okay, then yes. <sighs> Are you... Because... <sighs> I don't think he played Prototype. Brian's watching Netflix. <laughs> It works out well if they reach all the way across to the other side. Four times. Putting those under the, the desk. Oh, yeah. Although I think I can put them on top of it once we move the TV. That is true, too. You That's can do that. Thinking. So 11-4? Or were we going backwards? 11-4. Okay. I've noticed that on the Xbox... If you recently watched it, it goes back to it? If I play all episodes with commentary off, it gives, tells me the deleted scenes anyway. Oh, really? It did on disc three yesterday. Like, the little scissors come up. Okay. Uh, if you use the uh, Microsoft remote, all you have to do is hit the OK button to actually select the deleted scenes when they come up. Yeah, that's why. Let's see if it works this time. Because that's what I did yesterday or last night. 